Travis Reel set up big fishing day at exit 5. Uh, it's 93 degrees yesterday, 66 today, and even less in the morning. Let's see if there's some small fish out there. Of course, I, I never have bunker. Never have bunker get me a nice striped bass. So. I don't think I even brought my shrimp. Whatever. Maybe somebody will give me some. <laughs> to tell my friend Ricky to come by here. Nice day today. Got a lot of flounder a couple of days ago, so I'm hoping good flounder today. Even though it's colder, but it's really warm yesterday. Hopefully they got tricked. It's rising tide right now, 7 a.m. 10 a.m. is the highest tide, so we'll see. Little tiny but goldfish. Maybe I'll try fishing for them and then use them as bait. <laughs> oh, so the goldfish are here, so does that mean that uh, we got a uh, blackfish here? It could be. That's crazy. That duck is a goldfish. Just had a bite. I hope. I heard a ping, but he didn't swallow. It's got a bite. Big one. This one's big. I know like a landing. Really good. Wow. Fuck. No. <laughs> Shit. Dude. Yeah, dogs like flounder, man. Dogs like to eat flounder. <laughs> they love these. <laughs> a dog? That's fucking nice, man. Wow. Oh, fuck. It's like t probably 22 inches. Can't we got to land this motherfucker? 7:30 a.m. Let's go. I'm talking about wow, with the little hook, the five-inch uh, rope. Don't bite me now. Can't believe it. This is a big fucking. This is a keeper. 18 and a half easy. I think it's like 20, 21. Wow. It's crazy. <laughs> Oh, Flounder. Yeah, I can't believe I got it up. <laughs> What you put in the bite? <laughs> give, give me one second. I want to measure how big it is. Do I have my measuring tape? <laughs> it's too big. I don't know where to put my measuring tape. Shit. I gotta measure it. This is like 23 inches maybe. It's crazy. Can you take a picture for me? Yeah, like that's good. Take, take another one. Okay. <laughs> I gotta go measure it. Yeah. What happened to my measuring tape? Yeah. This is good to eat, this one. It's big! Mm -hmm. Maybe this one's uh, 
six years old. It's very big. I never got one this big here before. <laughs> yeah. Wow. <laughs> Hello, <laughs> 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 25 inches. Oh. Wow. Oh, I'm sorry. I think it's 25 inches. Oh, 25 inches. Wow, 25 inch personal bus. <laughs> wow, I'm going to get it. I'm going to get it. I'm going to get it. Twenty-six inches pulled up the rail on a twenty-pound gray line. Thank God I didn't break. I did the pendulum swing. The twenty-six inches off the pier is the five. Wow! Wow! Sorry. <laughs> okay. Now you can go. Wow! You can walk down <笑>你條線有幾重啊<笑> 喂,好了 <laughs> This, this was the little one that was in there. Oh, that was this. Uh, it's a big one. Huh? It's a big one. It's very sweet at the time. Huh? Yeah, you can take it. Huh? You can take it. You can take it. You can take it. Just swallow it. You can take 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 it. 你不要啊,我鮮的。好甜啊,好像黑斑甘甜的,你沒有看小的。Oh, the big fish caught it again. They are biting though. We'll see. Got another giant bugger. This one's big. And really cool. I knew they caught on. I think the thing is right in his throat. <laughs> Shit. It's up in the water. That's disgusting. Cute. Use him as bait. Oh, you high. Car low high, there. Oh, you have low. And this can be caught. Got clam and spider. I can use this for fishing. Right, take up baby, then hide it, take it. Man, this, I can catch it. This, I can catch it. This, this is clam, right? You have that kind? Very, very unique. 它在裡面有肉,好像包魚一樣 use it for fishing Just send that back to the rapid, bro Yes I like to kill them 
Alright, you want two kids then? You're invasive. Nice. Wow, it's a big one. Bye! This is a nice, big, fat one. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I didn't know it was that big. That's, that's tasty. I'm gonna give it to the old guy to eat it and taste it if he likes it. Hey! I saw it! You're a big fat one. You're a big fat one. Okay. I'll take it for you, I don't want to eat it. Yeah. Yeah. He, he doesn't know how to catch fish. I see him here last year learning, and uh, a lot of them don't really, they're not able to learn, you know. As you get older, your, your, your problem solving uh, is not so good, so I'm just glad I could get one from him. Damn, it's spraying water over. Whew. Let me wash him up a little bit. Nice size. This a big fat one, probably a quarter pound. Quarter pound of cheese, please. Ooh. Hate eating the salt water here. I'm gonna get disease. These things are pretty spiked. Ooh, you gotta be careful. I got, I got sharp fins. They wiggle. Pretty dangerous. There you go. Give it a, give it a nice wash. Caught three of these so far for the old guy. I didn't know this one's that big. I didn't, the blackfish would be here. Look at that. Hope it's not a crab. Could be a sea robin, but doesn't look too big. What is it? Got something. Okay. See, Robin? Oh, skate. <laughs> okay. Can't say skate. They yell, lah. 捉咗魚咪好嘢咯，你食唔食噶呢個？你食唔食噶呢個？佢即係好多人食啫，我俾咗我屋子食嘅都食嘅喎。我俾啲老人家喺北坡好多人食嘅喎。唔要我大把，我食過就。Okay. This is a little bit heavy. Okay, maybe I got one. Oh, no. Let go. Do you? You just let go. He didn't set the hook. Stop recording. Uh, I'm not going home yet. I'm going to work. <laughs> 1 30. Get the ice in there. Keep it, cool. Keep it fresh. That's a waste of ice. Yeah, keep it fresh. There we go. Lambo. Fresh baby. Look at that tail. It's too big. Oh yeah. Get that. Don't waste that ice. Let's go. All the time. Man, personal best. I don't know when I'll top this on sure. I mean, if I go on the boat line, I probably would top this in like a few months, but from sure, personal best 25 inches, I don't think I'll ever break it, to tell the truth. Rest in peace, Flounder. You'll be filleted for four dinners. So, I actually got it on this half ounce, uh, five inch, uh, what do you call it? Gold grub. Uh, I used like an 8 inch, 9 inch one. I think it was a little bit too big. Usually I use that at Jones Beach on sandy beaches. The bigger the better, but uh, an exit 5 with the high railing and the dirty water. I guess the 5 inch is better. So I got this 25 inch doormat flounder off of the 5 inch. So I was pretty excited. Uh, I was a little bit mad yesterday because it was 90 degrees and I should just took off work. 
and went jigging and Wednesday morning it was like 66 degrees and I'm like it's got so cold with the flounder be still there I was dreaming about it and I woke up at 4 a.m. because some dude named Adele text message and the beep woke me up <laughs> he's like overnight Uber driver I guess so uh I was awake eh, nothing better to do so I was like yeah let me let me get prepared to go out and I did some start eating had some ice cream finally got my house at like 6 30 and I was able to jig from about I would say 7 a.m. The first hour and a half, I didn't really get anything. Then around like 9 a.m., uh, it was rising tide, pretty high by then, because the high tide was 10, 10.08, I guess, for Wednesday morning. And I didn't get anything with the 8 inch, uh, like a grub, like green jerk, whatever it is. I don't know what it is, you know. Then I switched to a. Um, to my really old, like, uh, Andres, uh, Bucktail, and with the 5 inch, and the first cast, the 25 inch flounder just bit on it, and I couldn't believe it, you know, as you saw in the video, I, uh, I tried not to lift it out of the water, I kept it below the surface, so that he couldn't jump and flip and break my line in midair, and once I got him close, I put my the tip of my rod as far down as possible over the rail and then I did a golf swing people call it the pendulum swing and you just swing him over and don't give him a chance to like backflip off the hook so that's the best way to swing a flounder on top of a wooden pier or on top of, of a metal railing in a shore like a Exit 5 on the Belt Parkway. I mean, it's it's unbelievable, you know, I, I, I people tell you use like 10 pound, like 12 pound, 15 pound braid, but you can use it at the beach, but if you're gonna be like pulling a fish on a 20 foot railing, uh, and you're gonna be like jerking like plastic bait, you need at least 20 pound braid, right? So lucky I, I always put 20 pound braid you can even use 30 pound, right? Because these flounder will just bite anyway, you know? As long as you use some high quality 30 pound, like, like ultra, like thin uh, braid line. And then you could just, like, swing these giant fish over. <laughs> if you didn't bring a uh, fish grapple or a fish hook or a fish net. So, I'm very happy today. This is my personal best 25 inch. I, my my last personal best from shore or inshore uh, flounder fishing was 21 inches last summer at Jones Beach West End 2. This is 25 inches. Uh, this is a personal best. I don't, I never heard of people getting bigger than 24 inches off the shore. So I don't know when I'm going to break this inshore record for the flounder. Might break on a ship one day, but this is my personal best. I think it was eight to nine pounds. Uh, it will fillet like maybe six pounds. I'll probably give the head to my uh, mom's uh, uh, daycare nurse. They're really good at cooking fish. So the head is really good for like uh, fish soup or whatever. They love it. I mean, this head would taste great. <laughs> Tell the truth. Okay, guys. Thanks for watching. Good luck out there. I'm really excited. I hope somebody out there can show me you know what their best uh, flounder catch this is already the season two june 1st it's not even summer and we're here breaking world records with a uh, calico crab dirty and calico crab 25 inch uh summer flounder peace out